Hey guys, happy Sunday. So it's not Friday because I know we. <laughs> I don't want anybody getting confused thinking it's Friday. It's Sunday, uh, and I'm using my tools, practicing what I preach. Felt a little some anxiety coming on a little bit, and my head was starting to starting to think. So. Uh, to get on top of that, I'm back up outside of my where my this fountain is. I'll turn the camera around. Just up there's a main main stretch of road right there, so that's the traffic you can hear. And I'm just up by the fountain. Listening to the water. Tuning in. And uh, on the walk up here I just started to think of you know, like, what? Where's, where's it coming from? And, uh, I don't know, I started getting caught up with bits of news that kept showing up on my phone. I've got to shut that down. Because, <laughs> uh, news, news keep flashing up about different things. You might not even be into it. Like, stocks and... I haven't, I haven't, I haven't got no stocks. But something will, sh you know, flash up there and you... You catch on to it that its stocks are dropping or something, and all of a sudden you you're into that. And uh, you know things have been popping up about a recession and stuff like that, and found myself starting to get into that a little bit mentally, thinking. And then uh, when I came out, I thought there's nothing I can do about it whatsoever. I've never had a stock in my life and there's absolutely nothing I can do with what may go on apart from do my bit. And then I started thinking on the walk up here where I'm at now of where I came from because my mind, as soon as I switched my mind into a positive area, things started to come through saying you'll survive, you'll be fine and we'll all be fine because I think we, we forget of where, we're, where we've come from. You know, I, uh, I'm a guy from London, South East London. Never dreamt that I'll be in a position that I'm in right now and the, and the, and the, and the life that I'm having, and yet I moan. Um, you know, I'm a human as well. I keep the positive mind but, you know, I still get into the technology and, the, you know, the, the internet will go down. And what are we doing? Why ain't the internet working? Or, you know, all of a sudden you can't use your cell phone and we start bitching and moaning and our cell phone's gone down. Well, you know what? Maybe that's a message. Start tuning in and put the cell phone down and switch the TV off. We always want more. Why do we want more? You know, I know technology kind of takes off and it'll always be in front of us. But why do we always want more? Why do we always want the next best thing? Why do we always want the TV that's bigger? And you know, I'm just as much to blame for any of this because it's, it's you know, what's it covering up? What's it trying to prove? If we really sit there and think, what are we trying to, what is it is doing? You know, it, it's, the happiness is not long lived. You know, you may get that big screen TV and get it up on the wall and then all of a sudden it's like, wow, you can tell it's bigger, but you know, give it a month. I've done this myself. Give it a month and look at it. It looks like just like the TV you had before that and the one before that. And then you want the bigger one. It's like crazy. It's like, you know, am I trying to keep up with something or? So it's time to, you know, think of where you come from, what you've survived. You know, when I first came to the United States, I was 26 years old. I got here five days later, my dad passed. But you know what? My wife, well, girlfriend then, but my wife was right there, solid. And we didn't have anything. We had a little apartment. We used to celebrate if we got chicken because we, could, we couldn't afford it. We didn't, we didn't have the money, but we survived. We did it. 
you know and 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 i we get so i get so wrapped up in i think it's the letting go of what i you know what you have and and you know if you've got an abundance you know I, as long as you've got people around you as long as you've got people there you know it, it, it it's it's people coming together it's not about being an individual and trying to want more and be better and bigger and it's about everybody being this one people and loving each other and not trying to compete with anybody and compare yourself with anybody else because that's when the mind goes in the wrong direction there's only reality and that's it i think we lose touch with reality you know i had a really good conversation with uh with my, my mate over there dave over in england and uh, on friday really good conversation we was having he was asking me a lot of questions about about the mind and I, and I, I just start going into it and um, you know he, he asked me about reality like what's reality and presence and I'm like well first of all it comes an awareness of it you know and I think I think that's what's happening I think people have lost an awareness of we can survive you know we've been through we've been through a lot of we've been through a lot of shit you know and if you think about your individuality within your family as well and you know what you've got through there i mean come on guys so i stay you know i round about put it in a perspective of an understanding of the, the way the way i look at reality is the thing that's happening right there in front of you in the presence but and then if you look on the other side of that it's forever changing reality never don't stand still it's always changing so what are you actually looking at what's the reality you know, and I said to my buddy, we were both on the game, he's over in London, I'm over here on Xbox, and we, we was playing and talking, you know, even that, I mean, look at that, you know, I'm doing that, yet when the Xbox goes down, I moan, yeah, I'm talking to a guy on head, <laughs> it's crazy, but, you know, and I said, hey, listen, you know, the reality is we're both on the game, right, he's like, yeah, I said, so that's the reality of it, we're both exactly on the, we're both on the game, yep. I said, but you've got something different on your screen. So the reality, the reality you're seeing is a made up concept in your mind of what your brain's telling you, of what you're seeing compared to mine. Mine's totally different. I'm thinking differently because I have something completely different on my screen and my brain is connecting into the same reality. We're both playing the same game. <laughs> and then you start to think. And then it starts to bring you down to earth a little bit. And then that's what brings me back. And then coming up here and just getting in touch a little bit. So stay the course, guys. Don't give up on yourselves. Think. Think of where you come from. Think of what you survived. Think of, you know, even with relationships. Yeah, a relationship may go bad, but you know what? I'm sure you've survived others before that too. And, you know, and I don't even mean, you know, I'm, I'm talking about family relationships as well, you know. It's all those things that come from here and they hurt, but you survive. People support. So stay the course, guys. Namaste.